Hello, my name is Tinka and I'd like to thank you for choosing the most downloaded offline navigation in the world. Offline means that you don't need an internet connection while navigating, so you don't have to spend any mobile data. All you have to do is pick your destination. GPS satellites from the outer space provide your location. To get an accurate position, it's essential to be outdoors so that the satellites can find you. If you would like to test your GPS signal at home, try going close to the window. However, you don't need GPS signal while you are indoors. Sajic GPS navigation is really easy to use. We created this great user guide, but don't worry, you may not even need this after this video. Come closer so I can show you the app. Start your sidejig navigation by tapping on its icon. You can see a lot of things on the screen. I will walk you through everything. Let's start with these three lines. It's the menu symbol. After tapping on it, you will see several options. Sidejig store, where you can find our latest offer with exclusive discounts. Maps. You can manage your maps here. You can download the maps you need and erase them when you don't. The next section is settings. You can set up the language of your app, voice settings and a bunch of other things. But you don't need to change anything if you are OK with the default settings. To exit the menu, just tap on the map here or swipe the menu to the left. You can find a little heart in the top right corner and three dots in the bottom right, called the quick menu. We will get back to them later. Let's do the most important thing now. I'll show you how to navigate with this app. If you tap here on the search bar, the app will automatically show you the history of your previous search results, so that you can use them again easily. However, if this is your first time using the app, you won't see any history, so just start searching for a new destination. For example, let's try Peel Street 10 in London. Let's type Peel Street. Mm -hmm. And right there you can see many results in different cities. Let's add the street number. Now the results are more specific. So I can either continue specifying my search inputs or tap one of the results now. I will add London to the search. And you can see only one destination remains. Swipe up for more options. You can add the place to your favorites here or set as a starting point. Tap get directions to calculate the route. If there are more possible ways to get to your destination, you can choose between them very easily. Just tap one you prefer. After you have chosen the route, tap the start button. Now you can see information about your trip such as the estimated duration of your route, estimated time of arrival, the distance, and of course the previously mentioned quick menu. You can use the quick menu to turn on, off, sound, switch from driving to pedestrian mode, get more route information, or cancel the route.
Now let's get back to the little heart in the top right corner. You will find your favorite places and roads here. And here you can also set the location of your home and work. In this view, you can also see the address we just added to favorites. Tap on this arrow to go back. Here you can search in many different ways. Don't hesitate to try search for restaurants, addresses, GPS coordinates or postcodes. If you are visiting a new place, try out these icons called POIS, which stands for places of interest or simply places. They mark many exciting spots like tourist attractions, restaurants, petrol stations, some even with fuel prices, parking places and many others you can find all categories here. And last but not least, we have a very useful feature for everybody who is using the app in bigger cities with mobile data turned on. Sajik is an offline navigation, but we also offer a great online feature called real-time traffic information, which shows you the current traffic situation. You will get automatic, faster road suggestions so that you can avoid traffic jams. If this video wasn't enough for you, on this website you can find answers to the most frequently asked questions, other video guides, and if it is still not enough for you, here is the mentioned full user guide, which you can find on the same website. The link is in the description box below. Have a safe journey with Sajik. Was that okay?